Hello friends, welcome back to another video tutorial in Revit Architecture. I am Architect Sonorai from Glad Studio and in this today video tutorial, I am going to teach you what is section box in Revit. So you can see this building project here in image and you can see this rectangle like box here. This is section box. This is used to view your cut edge profile of building. So if you can look at the definition, you can apply a section box to a 3D view to limit the geometry shown in the view. The edges of the section box are cutting edges, so element geometry intersected by the section box will display using the cut object as style for the element. To display the section box in the properties palette for a 3D view, select section box. So you are required to go to your properties palette and check the section box and after that you can view your cut profile of your building. So I will tell you this by going to my Revit project here and you can work in only 3D view section box. So this is a 3D view of my building project. This is residential and now I am going to properties palette here and I will go to this extends here and now you can see this scope box that I will teach you in the next lesson and you can see this is the section box and you can see this is a box where we are required to check it this is unchecked and now i'm going to check this first and now i'm going to apply and you can see this rectangle like box around the building this is the section box so you can uh, select this section box and you can see this is the arrow bringing forward taking it downward and it is available on the all sides so if you want to view from the front side this cut edge profile you can drag this inwards and you can do it from this side also this side also any side if you want you can do it from this top also so i want to view cut profile from the front so i'm going to select this arrow and i will take it inside and i will going to make a cut profile here and so you can view this staircase cut profile here and if you want to take the print or you can save this uh, object here you can select this section box and you can right click and you can make this section box hide so i'm going to hide in view by category you can see your section box is hidden and you can take this print or you can adjust the section box further by going to this bulb like things this is a reveal hidden elements and if you select this you can view your section box but it will be not visible in your realistic mode so you can make adjustment in this uh, reveal hidden element so i'm going to select this section box here and i'm going to make adjustment i'm going to bring it forward so i want to view top part of this i'm going to make a cut here and i'll make it further here so i want to view ground floor so you can see this ground floor is visible now this is a cut section of this so i'm going to close this close the reveal hidden elements i will click once here and it is uh, in realistic mode and you can see your all interior parts if you are working in your interior design so likewise you can use this section box here and if you want to uh, again view your section box it is not here you said temporary hide isolate you can go to visibility graphics here and you can go to annotation categories and you can go to this section boxes it is unchecked so i'm going to check this and i'm going to apply okay and now your section box is back so likewise you can use this section box to view your cottage profile of building and in the next video tutorial, I will come with some scope box and selection box in Revit. So thanks for watching. Please like, share and subscribe my channel. Bye-bye.